Our first concern must be ensuring that the Nereid does not acquire the capability to create a water stone. Once she gets enough memory essences, there will be little we can do to stop her. Then we must hurry. To create the water stone, she'll infuse all those memory essences into something, probably the relics she's stolen. We need to find them. I think I know where the Nereid's lair is, but I'll need a distraction to get there. Yes. Go into the cavern and burn the Disciples' food supplies. That should suffice. Then come and find me on the upper levels. That's where I think we'll find the entrance to her lair. This is the entrance to her lair. I'm sure of it. I don't see her in there, so I think it's safe to go in and search for the stolen relics. Yes, I'll stay out here and keep watch. Take whatever relics you can find and look for some sign as to where the Nereid herself might be hiding. Even without a water stone, she's too dangerous to be left alive. To my sanctum? Traitor. I can't believe I thought you would help us. It is clear that you've given over to the same greed and brutality as those primeval seekers. But why would you dare enter my personal chambers? Liar. It's not the relics you want. You want to steal my memory essences, don't you? Too late. I've already infused them into myself. I am the Water Stone. Once I activate the shrine, I'll flood the ruins and rid myself of all you vermin. They have outlived their usefulness, as have you. Enjoy your last few breaths.
quiet out here. Did you find any relics? Any sign of the Nereid? She's turned herself into a water stone. That mad creature. I never would have even guessed that was possible. Fascinating. Nonetheless, then our only recourse is to kill her. And we were going to do that anyhow. Is she still in there? Blood the ruins! That would kill everyone! Which I guess would suit her just fine. Damn it. She's gone to the shrine on the east side of the ruins then. Quickly, we need to get there as fast as we can! You think you can stop me from flooding this place? Ah. the one the times of fate carried here to stop this transgression i had watched this pathetic spirit's attempt to avoid her fate with some amusement but i knew it would eventually have to come to an end where would be the fun in that the individual yarns of fate do not concern me? It is the tapestry they weave that I watch and record. All threads, even yours, only make up a small part of the whole. I do. I can see your future and your past. The yarn of your life is interesting, perhaps even amusing one might say. It is spun from a strong thread, to be sure, but all threads eventually run out. No. I did no such thing. Like moths to a flame, my followers are simply drawn to dark mysteries. This one was simply too irresistible to ignore. It is a wonder more of them did not die. No, why would I? Yes, that is what you will do. First, though, I have something for you. A gift. You might say. Whether you want it or not is irrelevant. I like to reward those who amuse me. And this is for you. You will take it. Ask more of me.